got my more boat running. Glad. I'm running just uh, some plain oil right now. Um, just because I had replaced the intake manifold. So I was getting a little water in oils last year, so I put a different intake on it. And, uh, so I'm running it, I'm going to run it for a little while with that oil in there, and then I'm going to put the, put the 2540 in there, marine oil. So, it's not sound too bad. Uh, it's probably sound a lot better and get a lot more lubrication once I get that oil in there. But right now I hook the garden hose directly onto it, so that because uh, I had that muff that wasn't doing as good a job as it should be so it wasn't getting proper water flow but I disconnected this line here and disconnected the garden hose they also had since you don't have water running through the water running through the, um, the pump here you have to take the pump off so you don't burn the pump up that's what I did. I took the, the pump off. I wouldn't bring the pump off so I can see that shaft. The pump over here. So, bolts and stuff like that. And yeah, so. Don't sound too bad. She's running pretty good right now. Yeah, that's the different intake that I had to put on it. I might have a. Uh, a little pinhole or something in my boot. I noticed it was leaking. And I'm not going to worry too much about that. It's only going to leak when the water's full through there. And that's what the ballast pump is supposed to help keep, pump out any water that does come into the boat. Yeah, but she sounds pretty good. Uh, don't really hear a knock of any kind. Um, Last year I heard a little bit because there was some water down in there. Um, and I got a few things I might need to tighten up. Um, a couple of drips. And I think it's more or less dripping from the... Which um, sounds pretty good right now. Um, and I get it heated up so that... Get all that oil running through the engine. And let, let, let the engine run for a couple hours and that will change over to full synthetic 2540 uh, outboard engine with Quicksilver filter. So. And, uh, I'll try to put it back uh, in the gears here so you can see it. And, uh, I'll go around there right now and put it back in gear. Here pushes the forward, but forward gear. Run it up just a little bit. A little throttle. There it is. Forward gear. Run it forward. sounds pretty good. Not completely under the load because it ain't really under the load until it's in the water. But it don't sound too bad. Uh, yeah, I see that, that little leak back there. I think it's coming. Uh, I must have a pinhole in my boot. It means I had to replace that boot at some point. I'm not going to really worry too much about that. For the year, you know, I'm, I said it's only going to leak while it's running in the water. So, as that water runs that, past that boot, it should be alright. Um, that ballast pump will keep up, up with that, anyhow. Uh, so, i put it back in neutral right now. And, uh, uh, yeah, it's a 1988 Larson Delta. Um, 
got it last year and it's having some problems with it. I hope I got all of it figured out. So I had replaced the intake manifold because the guy I had it before me had uh, changed the, the oil in the lower unit and uh, didn't do it properly so it didn't get the oil in the upper unit. Burn upper unit portion out and it froze solid so he probably blew the engine. So he didn't winterize it, drain the water out of the engine. So he ended up cracking the block and so it ran pretty good. And after I pulled up, he got a different engine or an outboard portion. I only paid $100 for that last year. But yeah, it sounds pretty good. Hopefully I won't have any more problems with it. I'm going to end up sooner or later changing over the burnt that kit and convert it over to the burnt cruiser out the, the outboard there. Because they have a lot of problems with these coal rust uh, shipping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sounds pretty damn good. Radio, I turn the radio on here to get that video going. Walk around the boat here. The other side of the boat. Yeah. Squeeze between the house here. Open up. Turn on my radio. Mess around with it a little bit. You know why it's not working? Here we go. I can't believe how much it turns me on just to be your man. Yeah! God. Listen to the radio now. There's no hurry. Yeah. Don't you worry. Yeah, it's not too bad. It's not too loud. Either. It sounds alright. So, yeah. That's it. Finally, the side of the boat. Alright, y'all, I think that's about it for this video. Uh, thanks for watching.